Back in the good old days of using a typewriter for written communication, we used to use tabs to format and organize documents. We still use tabs today in the world of digital documents. Now you set tabs in Google Docs using the ruler menu. If you don't see the ruler at the top of your Google Doc, right click your mouse and make sure you've turned rulers on. Now, an important thing to remember with tabs is when you set tabs in any document, the tabs will be set where the insertion point is in the, in the document itself. So if I set the tabs here while the cursor is here, if I move down into the paragraph, those tabs will not be reflected down here unless we copy them down. So remember that if you have trouble finding your tabs. Now, how we actually go about setting tabs is this. We right click our mouse and then we can choose a left, center, or right tab stop. If we choose a left tab stop, we can put it in place and we get the little arrow that tells us it's aligned to the left. You can adjust its location just by clicking and sliding. Let's also put a center tab stop in and a right tab stop in. Now let's uh, type in a little bit of text that we want to tab across. Brilliant. Now, if I put the insertion point at the front of the text and hit tab, the first place it should line up is on the left side because my first tab stop here is a left tab. I hit it and you can see that it has indeed lined up. So if you're creating any sort of structure and organization in your document, this is a great way to format and to line text up. If we hit the tab one more time, it's going to now set it up with the center tab stop that we put in place. And you can see that now the, the orientation line goes through the center of the copy of the text. And finally, we will take a look at the right tab stop, which should line up to the far right hand side. We'll hit tab one more time. And we can see that it's lined up on the right hand side. So setting tab stops inside of Google Docs is just that easy. Did we answer your question? If so, a like, a share, and of course a subscribe would all be greatly appreciated. Now, are there any other tutorials that you want us to create? If so, drop us a note in the comments and we'll see what we can do. Till next time, I'm Steve Dotto. Have fun storming a castle. <laughs>